How to Create a Locked On Stabilization Effect Hello! To create this effect, we need to find a suitable video. Easy Edit Viewer will help you with this task. It is a plugin with a huge number of graphic templates. For example, the Hyperset contains the most popular templates to help you create cool videos. Link to the plugin in the description. There is also a useful function with which you can add footage from popular sites. Besides videos, there are GIFs and images. Enter the keyword and choose the right video. Great! One click and a timeline video. Now let's turn on all the tools that will help us determine the center of our composition. Safe margins. Show guides. Show rulers. Now with the help of these cursors we can define the center point. Now go to the Effect Controls tab. Moving the image will create black spots on the edge. To remove them, you need to increase the video size. Now let's place the boxer's head clearly in the center of the frame. And with the help of enlargement we remove the black edges. Now you can create the first key. Click this button. Then switching to the next frame, we expose the image so that the head is in the center. It takes a very long time to create a key on each frame. You can do it every few frames. Here I will do it every 3 frames. And a big plus when creating an effect using the motion tab is that you can move the image not only using digital values, but also by dragging it with the mouse cursor. Great, all the keys have been put down. Now let's see what happened. In this case, the camera moves sharply and linearly. This can be corrected by changing the dynamics of the keys. This is what a linear speaker looks like. By clicking the right mouse button and choosing the easy in parameter, it is already clear that the dynamics have changed and will look different.
Now let's take a look at the second method for creating this effect. It is also quite simple to create, but there is a difference in the result between them. Turn on the markup to see the center. Add transform effect. We enlarge the image. And we set the starting point. Now we will create keys as in the first option. For more precise alignment, use small details in the video. In this case, I will always place our characters here in the center of the video. The keys have been created. Let's check the result. Great, everything works. Here you can also change the dynamics of the animation. But the most important detail here is shutter angle. With this parameter, we can create a blur effect at the moment the camera position changes. Having chosen the desired value, set the blur level. By changing the dynamics of the animation and setting the blur value high, we get a cool result. 